gentlemen, when I woke up this morning, man, I had severe heartburn. I mean, just killing me in my chest. It was just pain. Y'all know I'm 44. First thing I thought was, <gasps> am I having a heart attack? And then I said, no, I got too much work to do. God's not gonna take me just yet. I traced it back to my last meal, which was dinner, and I had some flavored rice. And normally I only eat brown rice and white rice. So the flavored rice got me. Now my mother suggested all these home remedies and then some over-the-counter medication. And I said, no, I'm not doing any of that. Why? Because the body knows what to do. If you cut yourself, the skin will heal itself. If you got something in you that doesn't need to be there, it'll figure out how to get it out. I call this the match syndrome. So what happens is if you light a match, it's just a little teeny tiny small flame that you can go and blow out. But if you ignore it and it catches fire to something else and something else and something else and something else, then it turns into a 15 alarm fire and it's like a forest fire. I've decided my schedule has allowed me to rest today and that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to allow it to do what it needs to do and let the heartburn go away naturally. Right now it's just a match. All it's going to do is blow out or burn out or I could go and it will be over. I think by the end of today. But what about your life? How often have you just had a match that you could have blown out and you ignored it and then it turned into a fire and a big fire and got bigger and bigger and bigger? People often ignore the match and they don't pay any attention to it. And then they're sitting in there and the heat is on, burning your butt and everything around you. So what's my point? You really got to start paying attention to the matches and stop and assess them, let them burn out, blow them out and get rid of the matches. No five alarm fires. With that being said, I'm going to go rest so that my match can burn out. And I will see you guys manana. Hasta luego. <laughs>